Yeah. Are you gonna wear that at the soccer tonight? Yeah, it'll probably be too cold. I'll have to put it on. Stay hunky! Welcome to another Hunky Food Dude Hit or Miss. I'm KP, this is Chris C. Today we're at Burger Incredible trying the Philly steak. The Philly steak! And we're gonna let you know if it's a hit or a miss right after this intro. KP, how you going? I'm good man, how are you? Look at another hit and miss. Again, we're by ourselves. We're by ourselves again. Everyone. Again. I don't know, this 1-800 number for Jimmy T is not working. So 1-800, where's Jimmy? We've had a couple calls, We've but couple no calls. one spotted him. He's like, He's like, where's Wally? You know how that, where's Wally, they're gonna have, <laughs> soon they're gonna be, where's Jimmy? Where's Jimmy? And there's just gonna be these books of all these pictures and just Jimmy standing there in the corner. Uh, but the thing is, you'll never find it. You won't find it, you can't, no one can. Like, it'd be like a little speck. It's yeah. impossible. Impossible. Johnny, don't know what happened to him, he, he quarantined, but it's like he's quarantined for seven years. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's gone. What have we got today, man? Well, today we're at Burger Inc. Burger Incredible. Yeah. Now, we have done a proper episode with Burger Incredible, but... And it was incredible, but, just putting it out there. <laughs> well, it was, but we can't... We uh, can't divulge anymore. Because we haven't brought that video out, but tonight we thought we'd do a hit or miss on their, their August edition, which is a Philly steak and cheese. Well, they, do like a, they do like a monthly burger, don't they? Yeah, so like a month, yeah, a monthly item. So yeah. on August, in August, it was it's, it's this. I'm not sure what they've done in the past. This is the first time we've done it, so we're trying it. And yeah, so this yeah, is only yeah. available in August. So yeah. after August, you won't be able to get this. That's it. So, but uh, yeah, so basically, it's a Philly cheese steak. So it's got a Scotch filler, fillet, grilled onion, uh, double American cheese, mayo on a buttered hog a roll. There you go. Now we know we we're saying that the Philly cheese steak in obviously in Philadelphia is massive. It's like we were saying it's like their Euros. It's like their thing. They love it. They have the steak on their roll with that like liquid cheese that they do in America and okay. they they love it. It's huge. Well so. I've never actually had a steak. I've never steak. had one here. It's, it's like a steak. We call it more or less a steak sa type oh, steak that, sandwich here, don't we? Yeah. You know, just without, it's like in a, it's in a bun with onion and that. It's more in like a hot dog bun sort of thing, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I've never, I've never, yeah, I've exactly. never, I've never tried it. So ever like, when I went to America, I didn't even try it. Nah, me neither. So, so this is first, this is yeah. first for me. Yeah. Burger Inc is, is an awesome place. So yeah, Burger I'm, Inc is um, amazing. I'm expecting this to be well, out there. We'll see how we go. Like we said, we don't want to give too much out because we haven't put the burger no. episode out. But no, no. If, if but it's as good as the burger that right. I got there. That's right. <laughs> but anyway, so, guys, no. before we get stuck into this, don't remember to like, share, subscribe, check out all of our social media platforms in the description below. And let's get stuck in, man. We'll see if this is a hit or miss, eh? We will, we will. Oh my god. Oh my it, it, the steak looks good, it does. It's there you go, as you can see, guys. It's yeah. Pretty, it's, a, it's like a hot dog bun, really. Yeah. It's like, a, it's like a steak sandwich in a hot dog bun, just. Pretty much with steak, onion, and cheese. Yeah, it looks, like, pretty, it looks yeah. pretty nice. It does look nice. The steak looks good, so. It smells good. It smells so, good. Cheers, man. Cheers, man. Here we go. Remember, stay, stay hunky. hunky. Let's go. All right. That meat's killer. Oh, the steak's man. good, isn't it? Mmm. It's soft. Like I said, the bad part is. I don't want to give away anything from that other, other episode. No, no. But we said on that other episode, was John, John's the owner, isn't it? That was his name, John. I think it was John. Sorry if I didn't get it right. I'm, I'm pretty um, sure it was John when we met him. Mm. Real nice guy. Real nice guy. The thing I said about his burger was, it was so juicy, it was like it was homemade. It was beautiful. And this steak is real nice, isn't it? It's soft, it is. it's juicy. It is. That, that's why I think he's, he's gonna do real well because it's like his product is real nice. Mm. So. Very nice. Mm. 
This is the first time I've ever had this, and I can say that this has become this is this is it's awesome, not, man. man. One of my, this is going to be one of my favorites. I think this is better than like you know sometimes steak sandwiches are nice, but if they're not made good, they're not good. If they're with bad steak, this is real nice. The steak is really soft, yeah. and then the cheese goes with it really well. You know what? That melted it, cheese. It said, didn't it say there was mayo on here? I can't really taste the mayo. I can taste steak. It says onion. mayo, yeah. I can taste steak, onion, and cheese. And it probably is mayo. Oh, there is. It probably but gives there it is. A, yeah, not much. It's, but it's not cacked on. It's, it probably complements it. Yeah, just that's why. what I'm saying. It's real nice. It's, it well, goes, it goes well. with the cheese, yeah. yeah. I can't believe how soft the, the meat is. It's real good steak, man. You can get good quality meat there. Uh huh. So, this is what the Americans crave about. Oh. Philadelphia in particular, I think so. I remember watching a thing on Man vs. Food and he was there. And they were just doing like challenges for him and there was ones that were like massive, like, you know, like a meal on hot dog in Hondo. <laughs> well, I think we could do a challenge where uh, we get them, we get someone to make it a Philly steak. Mm. As long as it's table. Oh my God. <laughs> Go buy one of those French sticks that are like mm. just massive and just... Mm. I really like, you know what it is, I say it about it again, I really like the meat he uses. It's it's tender, man. It's real good quality steak. And it's, it melt, it like, it's really soft. You know some steak is chewy? Mm. This is not like that at this all. It's not chewy at all. Yeah. When I first found out about this, that's what I thought was going to be like, a chewy kind mm. of steak. Yeah. And that's what I was a bit worried about, but it's not chewy at all. At all. I think the thing is with steak, correct me if I'm wrong, anyone in the comments, but I think steak is usually more chewier than lamb because steak is processed. That's the theory behind it. Right. Lamb is not. I think that's correct. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm correct, wrong, yeah. <laughs> correct me in the comments, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. Steak is a processed meat. That's why it's always a bit more chewy. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm not sure, man, but uh, whatever it was. Mm, that was good, man. Like, yeah. Hit this one first or what? Yeah. What do you reckon? So you know what I liked about what the big man said then? He said, do you want to hit this one first? He didn't even, <laughs> he didn't even say, do you want to review it? He just said, are you hitting it? Hit it! Yeah. I like big butts and I cannot lie. Because I've already, I've already conceded. He's, <laughs> It's already decided. <laughs> so do you just want me to do my review and we'll just stop? Because you know what he's going to say. Uh, listen, uh, it was real nice. I think the thing about it is, in Australia, we're not massive on our like cheese like the Americans. You know what I mean? No. They love it. And I don't think he's pounded it. He's put the cheese on there, like the two types of cheddar, like it says. But it really complements it. The caramelized onion is beautiful. The steak is real good quality. He, he, he gets good quality stuff there. I'm going to say it's solid 8.3 potatoes. And it's a hit. I like it. Like I, I would, yeah, I would, I would definitely get it again. Like if I didn't want to get it because his burgers, a lot of them are huge. If I didn't want to get something massive, I'd just get that. Yeah, yeah it's not too, it. it's not too big yeah. as well. So yeah, it's pretty good. It's in a hot dog bun, and it's the same size as like a hot dog. But I'd prefer that to a hot dog because I'd rather eat that meat than a sausage. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah. Wouldn't you? Like yeah. you know, it's better. Yeah. It's better quality. So all yeah. right, oh, man. Well, I'm basically pretty much the same as uh, KP over here, guys. The, yeah, the steak was like soft. It was so soft. Wasn't chewy, not too much cheese, but there was enough cheese mm. to make it, you know, really nice cheese that the melt, because it was the yeah. melted cheese. Yeah, yeah. And then the onion and then the mayo. This all went well together, guys. Yeah, yeah. And yeah, yeah. it's unfortunate that this is not going to be around for longer, because it's, yeah. it's only here for August, so. That's it, so. Burger Inc. John, I think it was, like I said, John, if you're watching, man. No, no, no. Will, will you do it as a... I'll do this. On, if I was... If I was will there, you do it as a special for the hunksters, man, or what? Come on, because <laughs> it's, it's beautiful, yeah. Now, the, nice. only, the only thing I would say that I improve on that, I like my bread crunchy. Yeah, right? fair enough. Now, if you had like a crunchier bread... Yeah, fair enough. I reckon go nine club. Yeah. It was. It was yeah, for me. Probably. For oh. me. For me personally. Yeah, so if you like, yeah, that's right. If it was the crunchy bread, yeah, yeah, it would yeah. go nine club. But you had the soft bread, which is still, which is still nice. Yeah. I'm gonna go eight point four potatoes, guys, yeah. and that, my friend, is a hit. Oh my god, that's wait. It's still going. It's still going. Hey. It's in the stratosphere. Oh no, they were nice, eh? Hey? Yeah. It was. Yeah, it was awesome, guys. As I said. Yeah, if you put crunchy bread with that, for me, yeah, it goes nine club. Yeah, yeah, they they, they, okay. they were good. I liked them. Like I said, I'd prefer that to a hot dog, and it's like the same yeah, size. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's just so unfortunate. That's only for, for mm. August. Like right? I said, man. Hopefully, when we come in there, you might be able to hook us up and uh, yeah, hook the hunsters up. Yeah, all year round. Yeah, all year <laughs> round. Philly steaks. To say you know, do it specially for, for HFD, man. That's right. But, but yeah, uh, but yeah, guys, burger incredible. Episode is coming out soon. Yeah. 
Not sure exactly when. There's a lot in front of it at yeah. the moment, but, but it is coming. It is make coming. sure you stay tuned because that episode is epic. So yeah, it was. So it was. So that's another hit or miss done, eh? Another hit or miss done, guys. Well, hopefully the hopefully the crew comes back. <laughs> We're not. We can't promise anything, you know. We don't speak for other people. But no. You know. And also, guys, we're going to be doing a lot of uh, stuff live on TikTok. A lot of our reviews live. A lot of our challenges live. So we'll be posting on our Instagram and our Facebook. So make sure you yeah. make sure you uh, follow us on uh, Instagram and Facebook to check us when we're doing oh, that kind of stuff. We, we've been doing that recently. The part, the past what couple past maybe four episodes we've been yeah. doing that. We've been getting good reviews from it. You know, people watching, people commenting, yeah. people really liking it. Interaction. Interact. Yeah. So we're and really interactive with it. With yeah, it, so. it was good. You know, we, the big man ate five whoppers in eight minutes, which was. <laughs> Still, reco- still recovering. He's still recovering, but yeah. <laughs> anyway, guys, before we go, remember to like, share, subscribe, and check out all our social media platforms in the description below. And we'll see you on the next hit or miss of Hunky Food Dudes. And remember, stay hunky. <laughs>